students. Welcome to another video tutorial. This is your teacher Cherry and today we are going to discuss about mutation. This is our most essential learning competency. Explain how mutations may cause changes in the structure and function of a protein. And we have our specific learning objectives. First, Identify the different types of mutations. Second, compare the different types of mutations and their possible results. And third, explain how mutations may cause changes in the structure and function of a protein. What is a mutation? A mutation is a change that occurs in our DNA sequence, either due to mistakes when the DNA is copied or as a result of environmental factors such as UV light and cigarette smoke. When you copy your notes from the blackboard, sometimes you make mistakes. In a similar way, mistakes may occur when DNA is replicated. Changes in the DNA sequence may delete such protein or change its structure. When the code in a gene is changed, a different message may result. Any change in the sequence of nitrogenous bases in the DNA or any mistakes in the transcription of genetic information from DNA to RNA or pairing of the codon and anticodon may cause changes in the kind. Sequence a number of amino acids of protein synthesized by the cells. Changes in the protein structure or level of expression may lead to changes in cellular properties and behavior. As a result, the organism is affected. Changes in the genes may occur or can occur for a variety of reasons. Mutation may be induced by factors called mutagens. Mutagens are commonly in the form of toxic chemicals and harmful radiation. Sometimes, mistakes occur in DNA replication, in mitosis and meiosis. All of these can alter the DNA sequence and length. Mutations can occur in two different types of cells, the reproductive cells and the body cells. Only mutation in sex cells pass on to the offspring. Mutations affect the reproductive cells of an organism by changing the sequence of nucleotides within a gene in a sperm or an egg cell. If these cells are fertilized, then the mutated gene becomes a part of the genetic makeup of the organism. If mutation is severe, the resulting protein may be non-functional and the embryo may not develop. There are two types of mutation that can occur in a gamete cells. We have the gene mutation and the chromosome mutation. Gene mutation is a permanent change in the DNA sequence that makes up an organism. In this figure, this is the original sequence of our DNA. We have here the arrangement thymine, adenine, adenine, cytosine, and thymine. In this point here, we have the point mutation, and instead of thymine, here we have cytosine. Chromosomal mutation occurs at the chromosome level, resulting in gene deletion, duplication, or rearrangement that may occur during the cell cycle and meiosis. It may be caused by parts of chromosomes breaking off or rejoining incorrectly, like we have here duplications, we have some genes that are duplicated, deletions, the, there are genes that are deleted, inversion, some genes are inverted, and translocation, some genes are translocated. When is a mutation inherited? Why are mutations in sex cells heritable? Many diseases are caused by the effects of inherited genes.
In most cases, there is only a small difference between DNA sequence in the defective gene and a normal one. This difference is enough to cause serious and often fatal diseases. These disease-causing genes are the result of a mutations. And sometimes, these mutations in the genes may be passed from one generation to the next if present in gametes. In this diagram, it shows changes in the sequence of bases in normal hemoglobin and one affected by mutation. This is an example of a recessive gene causes in a sickle cell anemia. We have here the normal sequence of DNA and the pairing. Partial RNA sequence and then partial amino acid sequence. We have here hemoglobin molecule, then the diagram of the red blood cells. Here we have here the mutations in the part in this part. So instead of adenine, we have here thymine paired with adenine. So instead of glue, it becomes val. And this is the diagram of the red blood cells. Sickle cell anemia. This is a case where most of the red blood cells stiffen and become sickle shape in affected people. This disease cells carries less oxygen than the normal cells. People affected by the disease will eventually die. Consider what might happen if an incorrect amino acid was inherited in a growing protein chain during the process of translation. This can possibly happen in a point mutation where a change in a single base pair occurs. Let us read the two sentences here. What happens when a single letter in the first sentence is changed? So we have here, the dog beat the cat. Then the second sentence, the dog beat the car. So instead of T, we have R is changed to R. So instead of cut, it's changed to car. So it is two different words already. So did you see that changing a single letter also changes the meaning of the sentence? A change in nitrogenous base in a protein may yield a different amino acid and a corresponding change in the protein structure and function. What will happen if a single base is deleted from a DNA strand? We have learned from our previous discussion that mRNA corresponds to the DNA sequence translated by ribosomes into proteins. If the new sequence with a deleted base was transcribed, then every codon after the deleted base would be different. Deletion or insertion of a base may change the reading frame of the codon leading to frame shift mutation. This is an example of a frame shift mutation. The effects of structural changes depends on their size and location, and whether any genetic material is gained or lost, some changes cause medical problems, while others may have no effects on people's health. The gain or loss of chromosomes material can lead to a variety of genetic disorders. Here are some examples of human mutation disorders. We have the Credochat. Credochat is caused by the deletion of part of the short arm of chromosome 5. Credochat is French and the condition is so named because affected babies make high pitch cries that sounds like a cat. Affected individuals have wide set eyes, a small head and jaw, are moderately to severely mentally retarded, and very short. Next we have the Down syndrome. It's usually caused by an extra copy of chromosome 21 or also called trisomy 21. Characteristics includes decreased muscle tone, soccer build, asymmetrical skull, slanting eyes, and mild to moderate mental retardation. 
Next, we have the Edwards syndrome, which is the second most common trisomy after Down syndrome. It is the trisomy of chromosome 18. Symptoms include mental and motor retardation and numerous congenital anomalies causing serious health problems. About 99% die in infancy. However, those who live past their first birthday usually are quite healthier thereafter. They have a characteristic hand appearance which, with clenched hands and overlapping. Next, we have the Jacobson syndrome. It's also called terminal 11Q deletion disorder. This is a very rare disorder. Those affected have normal intelligence or mild mental retardation with poor or excessive language skills. Next, we have the Klinefelter syndrome. Men with this condition are usually sterile and tend to have longer arms and legs and to be taller than their peers, and they often are shy and quiet and have a higher incidence of speech delay. Turner's syndrome. Female sexual characteristics are present but underdeveloped. They often have short stature, low hairline, abnormal eye features, and bone development, and a cave-in appearance to the chest. Here we have chromosomal mutations like translocation, deletion, and inversion. Question number one, how many chromosomes are involved? In translocation, we have two. Deletion, we have one. Inversion, we have one. Question number two, how did you change the original structure of the chromosomes? For translocation, broke apart and attached it to another chromosome. Deletion, broke apart. Inversion, broke apart, reversed, and inserted it into the chromosome. Question number three, which condition or conditions do you think result or results to a change or changes of chromosomal material? Translocation, either gain or loss of genetic material. Deletion, loss of genetic material. Inversion, either gain or loss of genetic material. Thank you for watching students. Again, this is your teacher, Cherry. Always saying... Keep learning and stay safe. Thank you and goodbye.